Oh my God, it's real. Hi, I'm Alicia, I'm 26 and I'm from Sydney. Hi, Alicia. My dad and my mum, they used to, when I was younger, get me downstairs whenever anyone was over. They'd be like, can you sing that song that we love? <laughs> I'd be like, oh, mama, that's so lame. But I really don't think I could get up and sing a song if it wasn't for them. So yeah, I owe it to them. My mum's like my best friend. We have watched this show together for the longest time. We've even been to a live show together and I've always turned to her and said how cool it would be for that to be me up on that stage. You know I'll be mouthing every word. Oh, I know you will be. <laughs> <laughs> I forget the words, I just look over at you. You've got yeah. this. <laughs> About two years ago, my mum was diagnosed with esophageal cancer, so she went through chemo and radiation, we're all being, sorry. <laughs> we're all being super positive and it makes it so easy when she's so positive. I love you. I love you too. Mm, you know, I'll be there with you. I, know. I think she'll definitely be the one screaming the loudest for a chair to turn. Knowing I can look over and she's gonna be there is what I think will get me through. Wow. You just, you can't go wrong with that song. Actually, you can, but, but, you, but you didn't. <laughs> oh, phew. <laughs> Normally, what we see is an artist nervous at the start because the chairs aren't turned yet. And with you, it, it was like the other way around. But I only sensed your nerves when you got all the chair turns. It, it was like something you didn't necessarily think about and then you were confronted by it. To be honest, I, I was here, I love what I do, but it was just so great to have my family here. So regardless of the outcome today, I was just happy to be singing here. So to see a chair turn was, I don't know, unexpected, I guess. But yeah, <laughs> but amazing. Yeah. I mean, look, you've got four, four chair turns That's right there. Amazing, Incredible. I'm, I'm speechless. Beautiful. <laughs> he really did such a great job and that's a skill. You really did, you held us all in that moment and it was great. Thank you so much. That means a lot. What I loved so much about it was you took your time. You were patient with yourself and you didn't do too much, you know? And it wasn't like, oh, I'm doing this song. I need to show off my vocal. It was just really still and calm. And I felt very safe with you. And that is what you call a good audition with a good song choice. That was a really good song choice for you. Thank you so much. Yeah. yeah, it's getting the right song is so important. Alicia, that was such a good song for you because it really, it just framed your sweet spot vocally. And it looks like also framed you as a person too. Why did you choose that song out of all the songs you could have sung? Um, my mum's been struggling with cancer for the past two years. So I felt like with 
this song I could really change the lyrics and mm. make it more about having her feel my love. So, mm. yeah. Oh, don't. <laughs> See, that's, uh, another, that's another amazing thing, to find that root, isn't that's it? That's what's going on in that song with you. It's just beautiful. Thank you. You literally had connection through it all. You had vulnerability, you had emotion, and I think now that you tell that story and, and obviously that connection and, and dedication to your mum, um, it makes sense that you, you know, almost it was like a cry, you know, is that kind of dear mum, you know? I definitely felt like that. And I would adore you on Team Jess. I, I would love to have you. Thank you so much. Who you choose? You know, I know how it feels to sort of like have that connection with the song and then that memory always sticks with that song. My mum, she also um, had cancer. When she would go and get her treatment um, and she was like losing her hair and stuff. And um, we, were, we were kind of teenagers and it was like really weird to see sort of like your mum like not be like the superhero that you always think a mum is going to be, you know? Absolutely. Because you never think your parents are going to sort of like break down in front of you, you know what I mean? And then you have to sort of like put them together. Um, I can't even speak. She had breast cancer. Um, I'm so sorry. Yeah, but no, it's okay because it's also something she talks about. She's a survivor, but um, uh, she had it super young, you know? And I think it's so important to have that, that memory with them. That's why I thought your emotion was so spot on. And I think that song was such a great song choice for you. Amazing. You know? Thank you, yeah, absolutely. Um, so I think whoever you choose, my advice would honestly be try and connect a memory to that, to those songs. So then that, that same power that you had in this audition will carry you through in every performance because that obviously is your magic. Yeah. Thank you so much, absolutely. Yeah. Thank you. So, I just wanted to put that out there. I don't really talk about my mum like that. So, you know, I want you to know that. It's hard, yeah. yeah. It's really hard, you know? Absolutely. But this is a moment of pure celebration. You have four chairs that desperately need you. I, I'm honestly lost for words. Like, to work with any of you would be such a blessing. So thank you all for turning. Um, oh, wow. The team that I would like to be on is Rita. <laughs> Rita also grouped together ballad singers Alicia and Chloe and country sisters Ella and Sienna to fight for one battle place. I know you haven't made your mind up yet. But I would never do you wrong Would I make me close my mother? I don't want to hurt anymore Stood I knew you Stepping on the last train Marked me like a blood stain I, I knew you Their vocal blend is impeccable There's no other act like them in the entire competition Ella and Sienna. 